What is the best way to install applications to your Android TV, especially without Google Play Store? In this video, I am going to be showing you my best source of third-party application to my Android TV and it is not downloader, it is not on link, it is not APK time. It is an application that most of us will ignore on our Android TV. So make sure to stick right up to the end of this video because I am going to be showing you everything step by step. And if you like this video, make sure to subscribe and also share for more important videos like this. That's it, let's get into it. On Android TV, a big challenge that many people have is how to install third-party applications, especially when on your Android TV, they don't have the Google Play Store app like me. On my Android TV, I do not have Google Play Store. And I'm going to show you my best source for third-party applications. And it, as I said earlier, it is not downloader, it is not on link, and it is not APK time. It is just an application that we all ignore on an Android TV. It is something that it is on every Android TV. Every Android TV comes with this application. So this is definitely going to work on any Android TV that you have. Whatever version of Android TV that you have, just try this out and you might be able to install third-party applications without having to need sophisticated applications like downloader, on link, codes, or so on. What I'm referring to is just by using our browser. Yes, any Android TV comes with a browser. It can be a Google browser, it can be Chrome, it can be a system browser, or it can even be a custom browser. Every Android TV or smart TV comes with a browser. And on your browser, you can use that browser to install any application that you're looking for on your Android TV. And I'm going to be showing you that on this video tutorial. So make sure to keep on watching. So this is my browser. This is my Google browser. On Google browser, once you go out to it, the best thing you have to do is to log into your browser. Now, if this doesn't work for your browser, you can install an additional browser like TV Bro, Chrome, or any of the popular browsers that are best for Android TVs. But for me, I'm going to be using this because this is my system browser. And I'm going to use it to install applications without needing downloader, without needing on link, and definitely without needing the Google Play Store application. So what do I do in this case? Now for instance, if I go out to my browser and I'm logged into Google, and I'm searching for an application, let's say I'm looking for the VLC application. What I'll do, I'll just go back to the search box here, and I'll type in VLC app. Stick with me, I'm going to show you everything. I'm just going to come out here and I'll type in VLC vlc app so this is what i'm going to type vlc app and then i will search when i start typing vlc app the first option that's going to come up on my browser is the option that is going to lead to the web page or the web version of google play remember i don't have google play on my android tv if i come out to my browser this works on any browser i come out to my browser and search for an application that is available on Google Play like VLC, then it is going to show me the web version of Google Play and I can go ahead and install the application without needing Google Play Store application on my Android TV. So like for instance here, I can go ahead and install this application without any issues. And since my, Android, my TV is an Android TV, it is going to install and it's going to work without any issues because these applications have been customized to work on any monitor, to work on any screen as long as it's an Android operating system. So if your Android TV is an Android operating system, then this is going to work for you perfectly even if you are installing from the web version of Google Play Store. And as you can see on my screen right now, I am currently installing the VLC application from my web version of Google Play. I did not use the Google Play Store app. I'm just using my browser and this works perfectly. I don't need to install downloader or look for Google Play. I can just install it from the browser and once the application is done, if I return home, I am going to see the application has been installed on my Android TV. So I go out to my applications and I scroll down a little bit to see if VLC has been installed here. And here is it. I can go ahead and use it without any issues. Now the next question you should be asking is, what if the application is not found on the Google Play Store? How can I install it? Yes, you can still use your browser to install this application if it is not found on the Google Play Store. And I'm going to show you just how. So let's say for instance, VLC was not available on the Google Play Store. And I still want to use this method to install the application to my Android TV. What I'm going to do is, I'll still come back to my browser on my search box. And what I'm going to type this time will be, I'm going to type in VLC. Now, once I type in VLC, I'm not just going to type app. I'll go ahead and type A, P, K. Now, in the first time, I just type VLC app. But since I know this application is not available on the Google Play Store, I'm going to type in VLC APK. Why? Because now I am looking to install the APK of this application and not just the app. The APK is a file that's been hosted on third-party sites 
on the internet that can install without any issues. As I say this, of course, you're going to get a result of Google Play Store, and we are not going to use that option for now. What we are going to do, we are going to go to third party options. And as you can see on my screen, here are two third party options. This is one of them. Up to down is one of the best third party sites in which you can install an application. And to install an application, you just have to come over here and click on it. As you click here, you are going to come down and you see get the latest version over here. So you can install the latest version there. But for, for this video, I'm not going to use up to down. What I'll use is this other option here. I'm going to use this option of soft on it because this works best for my Android TV. So you can do the same with any application. Just search the application and make sure to add APK at the end. They can download it on your Android TV. The reason I'm searching this is because this works perfectly on a, on a TV that has an Android operating system. Because if you're using a smart TV, this is not going to work for you. If you're using a Fire Stick, this might not work for you. But if you're using an Android TV, then this is going to work perfectly without any issues. So once you go over to a site like this, I'm going over here and you download the application without any issues. So just click on download and the application is going to start downloading after a while. And after it's done downloading, you can install it to your Android TV. As I say, this works on Android TV and you can use any third party site on the internet to install. But now, how do you know a third party site is secured? They can install an application without any fears. You have to look at these little things here. You look at a trusted program here and also look at the number of downloads. This site has 4.7 million downloads of this application. So you know you can download this application without any fear. Why? Because lots or tons of other people have also installed the application from here. So that's how to know if a site is secured to install an application. Look at the number of downloads that are on that site. If there are just a few, then it's a sketchy site and you should run away. But if there are many downloads like this, they can go over here and they click on the application and download the Android TV. Once it's done downloading, you can go ahead and install without any issues. So this is how this works and these are in some most of my applications by using third party site on the internet without needing downloader, without using on link or without using APK time. I just come back to the internet, I search for application that I want, I type in APK at the end and then I install the application to my Android TV. So as you click download here, it's going to start downloading the application like this. Just give it a moment, you see your download has started. Once this is downloading, the application is going to start downloading to your Android TV. So now it's going to say, do you want to download this application? Okay, I downloaded it. Downloaded it. So I'll just click download and the application is going to start downloading and I can click on details. I can click on details and here's the application downloading. When it's done downloading, what you have to do is just click on it once and then it's going to ask you to do you want to install this application i already have the application on my android tv so i don't need to install it again so it, in your case it's going to be installed here you ask you, do you want to install the application and you just go ahead and click install i can install the application without any issues and this is how i install applications to my android tv without using google play store without using downloader and without using only if you found the video helpful make sure to like subscribe and share for more important videos like this